I can't get enough of this view. Welcome to my channel Live on Alberta. My name is Carrie and I love hiking. My videos will show you all the aspects of the trail and what you can expect to see if you choose to do this hike. Today we will be summoning Saddle Mountain in Banff National Park. As a bonus, it's large season. The trail is 8.2 kilometers out and back with an elevation gain of 658 meters. Well, once again, we're at beautiful Lake Louise. We're in the parking lot here. Temperatures about one degree Celsius. We're gonna hike up to Saddle Mountain, which is behind that one, which is Fairview Mountain. Well, 99% of the people are gonna go to the right here, but we're gonna go to the left. So we're gonna go to Saddleback Pass and then up to Saddle Mountain. And here we go. Okay, we're coming up to another sign. So we're gonna go left. In addition to climbing Saddle Mountain, I'm hoping we're going to see some beautiful arch trees. And I'm solo today. First hike I've done solo in a while. Well, 0.8K. Come up to another intersection here. So, Fairview Lookout is to our right. Saddleback Pass. To our left. And another sign. So horse trail to the left. We're gonna start gaining elevation here. Colors are slowly changing here. It's weird. Quite a bit of deadfall in here. Well, we're 1.6k in, and we're coming up to our first opening. Look at this, just gorgeous. Our first large tree. I think once we get up to Saddleback Pass, it's just going to be gorgeous. And here we are, looking across the Bow Valley at Lake Louise Ski Resort. Watch how fast these clouds are moving. And our first major switchback. Look at all this moss here. Just beautiful. A few more large trees. I think it's gonna be magical once we get up there. Well, I'm hoping anyhow. Yeah. It's opening up quite nice here. Get a beautiful view of the Bow Valley now.
Well, we've been gradually going up, but now we're going up very steep climb here. Oh my God. Well, that sucked. We're at 2.7K. Come up to this intersection here. And so we can take this trail, which is the main one that all trail says, or we can take the high road, which is a shorter one, but steeper. I think we're gonna try this one. Most of the people are going that way, but I feel adventurous. So, no pain, no gain. Well, let's be a sucker for punishment to do this. But I've got some great tunes I'm listening to. Okay. And a few other people passed me on this one as well. Looks like we're gonna break out here again. We're at 3.1K in. Oh, I see snow. Okay, so here's where we made up with the other trail. And back on the main trail. More and more larches. Ooh. Well worth the effort so far, in spite of my little bit of whining at the beginning. But my legs are fine now. Just got to get into it. Still making us work for it. We're 3.6K in. And we are amongst the largest. Oh, wow. Look at them. Wow, it's nice that the sun's on them now, too. My first Pika. That's Fairview Mountain there, but we're not going up there today. We're going up here somewhere. Well, getting into the rock now. It's the switchbacks. This hike kicks 
Large Valley in the butt. Large Valley is nice, but you're sharing it with a thousand of your closest friends. I've seen about 30 groups up here, but nothing compared to Large Valley. And the views are stunning. So there's Mount Temple. Some people on the ridge there. I think we're just gonna go up that ridge there, at the top of Saddle Mountain. And just looking down the switchbacks. Probably eight or 10 of them have come up so far. Well, we're 4.3K in. Look, what we see in front of us. And we know Mount Mattis. Mount Temple. No, well, things are pretty much leveled out here. So I think pretty soon here, take a quick little break. We're 4.5 day in. And we've made it. We made it to the top of Saddleback Pass. And we're going that way. Yeah. Nice little rock here for lunch. It's just magical here. Look at that. Might go check out a view after. Another trail going that way. Look at that mountain. Unreal. Look at the rocks. Let's go over here and have a gander. Looking at the Bow Valley here. Not that bad. I thought it'd be more of a scramble. Just walking over these big rocks. I can't get enough of this view. Oh my god. So here we're looking at Mount Temple. There's Lake Annette there. We hit that lake last year. We we're hiking to the Giant Steps. The creek down there is Paradise Creek. Now you can see that open spot there where we had our break. Okay, I lied. Now we're gonna have to Get into some hands on here. That path has disappeared. Well, I can see the cairn for the summit. Ooh. 5.3k to the cairn. A 
Saddle Mountain. Okay, here we go. Good 360 here. Well, wow. well, after a nice little break, time to head her down. There's the Chateau Lake Louise down there. And here we go. One last look back at the summit of Saddle Mountain. I can't get enough of this view. Well, we're back on the main trail now. Well, when it's all said and done, probably gonna be 10 or 11K. But that was going right up to the top of the saddle. But if you wanna see larches, and you wanna be on a beautiful hike, without a thousand of your closest friends and hike up to Saddleback Pass. You will not be disappointed. This was definitely the perfect hike to do on the last day of summer. And we're back. In total, we hiked 10.2 kilometers out and back with an elevation gain of 670 meters. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and a comment would be greatly appreciated. In my next video, we will be doing a loop hike up Corey and Edith Pass, where we get the shit scared out of us. A big male grizzly crosses our path 20 feet in front of us. If you would like to see more hiking videos, subscribe to my channel Live on Alberta where I feature over 60 hikes. Cheers.